I just watched um, the for the first time the nineteen thirty eight film Robin Hood with uh, Errol Flynn. With Errol Flynn. Wow, what'd you think? It was awesome. Cool. It was, huh? it was uh, it's one of the probably earliest films I've ever seen. It was yeah. predates Casablanca. Oh predates, yeah, it's like same director as Casablanca, by the way. Um, I've I've never seen the whole film. I've yeah. only seen it's, highlights from it. It's cool to see the history. And how this film and and how differently they did stuff in 1938. That's almost coming up on a hundred years. Isn't that nuts? Uh, yeah, and Errol Flynn was the man. Oh yeah, he was the Tom Cruise of the day back then. Even he, uh, way, even bigger. Big, a lot of charisma coming from Errol Flynn. Yeah, um, and so it was really that's it was fun. Super. It's like you're watching a piece of history, basically. That, I did that with Inherit Inherit the Wind. Have you ever seen that, no, the Spencer? I seen oh that. my goodness, I I watched it because I I can't believe I had never seen it. Spencer Tracy is. If you want to see somebody who was doing natural acting before Brando and Method, it's Spencer Tracy. And he's so good, but the Pasadena Playhouse is doing the play. So there's auditions for it in the middle of the month. I, there's three different roles that I could play in that thing. If you, you I showed it. it to, yeah, I showed yeah. it to Indrani. She was blown away at how contemporary and relevant that film is from 1960 to today. It feels like it was written today. Yeah. It's amazing. It's amazing. So, oldies are awesome. Josh! Hey, welcome back to our stupid directs. I'm Corbin. I'm an oldie. And you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter, for more juicy content. Thanks, page, follow us on the like button. What qualifies you to be an oldie, technically? Uh, old age. I don't know. <laughs> and today we got uh, another cricket video. This is a 10 lightning fast stump, st stumpings ah. from Emma Stoney. I remember when I stumped I, your mom. Yeah, I was just going to say, I know a lot of women out there who really like, and men, who like really fast stumpings. And we have seen uh, like compilations of Emma Stoney doing different things, including stumping as well. So, But this is a uh, another one. A, he was obviously well known for well, everything. The, and these are just his stumpings. And I did in the... In the fan reaction to the the win of CSK I said the end thing was Emma Stoney it wasn't Emma Stoney he was on the team but it was it was a different oh the winning shot yeah oh yeah I thought it was Emma okay. Stoney but it wasn't I didn't know who did it um people were very quick to correct me there I bet they were <laughs> <laughs> um but uh so this is uh I would say that Emma Stoney was known for his stumping but he was known for literally I, everything literally everything all around player yeah uh so here we go button and never miss another update from extra innings. This is Hitesh and today I will present you 10 lightning fast jumpings of MS Dhoni. Do watch till the end. Okay. Okay. What happened? <laughs> no, like the, the I know. Yeah, I know, but it happened so fast. Yeah, that's like, lightning fast. <laughs> like he catches it, and it's almost right. immediate. Like he can't even react to put his foot back. Wow. <sighs> you got to have the reflexes of oh a cat. Oh my goodness! You can't get a lot closer than that. <laughs> that's about as close as it gets. Like, I couldn't even see that being, like, safe. What is that? Is that a person? I think so. Oh, that could be I don't Same even, thing. I don't even I know. see him move his arms. But he's still going for the third umpire. I just get the feeling he might be out. But making Maru stretch right forward, losing his balance as he played. Wow. And uh, that looks lovely. As if he couldn't get his foot back, his foot was in the air, and Maruf, in fact. Oh, oh beautifully! Again, I don't see him move. This is a fine delivery. <laughs> like I just see, like cat. I don't even see him move. This is a high quality keeping. And a after some very poor overs for India, this is just the sort of thing they wanted. Excellent ball from Ganguly. Prior on the walk. They only showed this series already how good he is. Oh, the dead to rights. Took that big step forward. 
Sachin to take revenge against Whoa, after a six. <laughs> he did that real bye bye. <laughs> I think he waited and then the guy said it. He said bye bye. This is how he was dismissed. Like he waits. Yeah. <laughs> yep. He's got the motor turn and he's I think doing his good man. I don't I never see him move his hands. The batsman has walked off. He's dragging his foot while playing a defensive shot. What a way to start. Appears it's instant. Delight. He's gone for all his money. Murray Kartik is affected another breakthrough. The field has reckoned that Samuels is dead and gone. Let's have a beating. Drags that back foot and wow. appear to get back Marlon Samuels. Appear to get back. I think he's on his bike. Dang! Well, that might be out. And I cannot see it in real time, man. Thing. He's gone. Oh. That's something I just realized as well. It has to be on the ground, not just break the line. Yeah. Second wicket. He started around right there. Then he's followed again. Good stumping by Dhoni. Not very easy when the ball turns. It comes between the back and back. I like seeing it from the side. <laughs> oh! How did he not get back? He's poor, but then. <laughs> he lost the ball. And that's high in the air, but he's got enough on it. He's amazing. Absolutely amazing, Shade of Freedy. What happened? I'm confused. There was this. Oh, it's like the, their answer? Gotcha. Gotcha. So they showed the four, and then they showed the after. So is that one of the rules for a batsman? To subscribe extra innings to get latest in so you have the wickets, mm -hmm. and then you have the space between the wickets and that line. Mm -hmm. Does the batsman, can they stand anywhere they want to stand? Do they have to straddle the line? Do All I know is, if they're outside the line, obviously, they have to get back across before the catcher hits a wicket and stumps them. Yeah. My question, and if you've told us to this before, forgive me for not remembering, is when a batsman is taking their position, are there rules? Because, for example, the only thing that we can approximate this to for us that we know is there are rules of there's a batter's box. You can stand in certain places, up, back, side, in, but you have to be in. The, if you put your foot out of the batter's box, that's you can't do that. Yeah. Uh, so I'm, I would like to know, does a batsman... Every single one of them seemed to be stepping forward. Yeah, I think you and were over the line when they were going to strike the ball. I think you maybe that's the rule. You have to be over the line to strike the ball. Yeah, You're like that would make sense because they because would, otherwise, why would you ever put your foot over the line? Yeah, it's like you can't put your foot on the the in baseball. Game. Right. So my my suspicion is you could probably stand anywhere, but you have to be you have to have both feet over the line if you hit it, and then get back if you miss it. Mm -hmm. Right? I think so. Help, help. 
<laughs> I'm one and oh. I'm pretty sure that's he, but yeah, he's lightning fast. Oh my it's, it's, like, it's I mean it's similar but not the same as a, a, a catcher in baseball in, in the reflexes they need to do yeah. a lot of different things. Same reflexes, just different use of them. Yeah. But yeah, same hand eye coordination. It's like to throw to to first, to throw wherever obviously the person's going, or obviously to um But it's it, also completely different. It's also like an infielder too, because Catchers seldom ever have to catch a ball that's bouncing that far in front of them. Yeah. It's a whole other animal with that. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, he's um, he's really good at cricket. Yeah. Uh, in case anybody wants to know. <laughs> uh, will you be in L.A. when the Knight Riders are playing? Because we will be. In Estonia? Will you be there? My um, thoughts is, because last time we... Not the last time, because obviously Florida was before India. Florida was before India. That was so we've seen two cricket matches. Yeah. Um, the first the, Florida was the summer of 2000. It was the first year of the channel. It was 2019. Yeah, it was the first year of the channel. Yep, because we were in India in 2020. And uh, Steph was pregnant. Yep. Um, but we did a, I remember, because we did a red eye. Yeah. We saw the game. Right. And then we left the next, the next morning. The next morning. So we were gone for maybe 24 hours. Right. Maybe. Um, <laughs> it, was a, it was a real quick trip. Uh, and the game had to uh, be delayed. stopped. Yeah. yeah we, we had to be delayed because of lightning. Yeah. Didn't even get to finish it. Yep. But uh, I, I'm i wondering if the... Because uh, I got concessions and they had like Indian food, of course. They had like right. samosas, but it was really spicy. <laughs> <laughs> it was also really humid. Yes, because it was Florida. Yeah. Uh, it won't be that here. No. So if you need humidity for a cricket match, it ain't you here. will not have it, it in will Los be dry. Angeles. You might be used to the heat and humidity in India, because I know it's both of those. It is dry heat here. It is like an oven. Uh, <laughs> so yep. I, I don't know how that's going to affect your fields. <laughs> 5% humidity. Yes. As yeah. opposed to 100 in it, Florida. The, the fields, I would imagine, are going to be kept the way... NFL and MLB fields are kept up. They're going to be really nice. They'll probably have underground watering systems for them. Um, but I'd, I'd imagine your Indian population I'm is excited. a lot bigger here than it is in. Um, where was? Where did we go? In Florida? Where did we I go? don't know. There's quite a few. Well, there's Indians everywhere. Obviously, yeah. We got a, we got a few million here. So uh, we were we were in Miami, Fort Lauderdale, Fort Lauderdale. That's, that's where right. We were. we were in Fort Lauderdale. I can't remember. Uh, we flew into Miami. Correct. Drove to Fort Lauderdale. Drove to Fort Lauderdale. Um, It was just cheaper that way. Anyways, uh, let us know what other cricket videos uh, from MS Donnie or others that we can react to down below.